A train is traveling west to east at a speed of 300 km per hour. The driver applies the brake, producing a deceleration of 1.4 meters per second. In newtons, how hard will the man in carriage 7 now get his face mashed into the seat in front of him and realize that most of the problems in his life are created not by external circumstances, but his own repeated self-sabotage? Are human tears primarily composed of water, antibodies, a quiet admission that all of our plans and dreams will eventually turn to forgotten dust? Or salt. Daniel gets salty at criticism and admits he is wrong about something never. In years, how long will it be before he alienates all of his friends with this behavior and finds himself entirely alone? Rachel has chosen to remain alone at home for the evening and drink two liters of red wine. Please identify the correct chemical formula for consumable alcohol. Is it C2H6O, C2H5OH, or the 17th time this year Rachel has attempted to solve an issue by escaping it internally, simultaneously knowing at some point, however painful, she will have to confront whatever it is that went wrong and why. If Y is a sense of purpose and the X axis is the course of a human lifetime, please explain this result's significance. Alice and Pierre are having a significant disagreement. Pierre says, why doesn't Obi-Wan Kenobi remember R2-D2 in Star Wars Episode 4? Alice says, no, he did, because, like, remember when he calls him my little friend? Pierre says, yeah, but he said he'd never owned a droid before. Alice says, that's because R2-D2 was Anakin's study figure 66 of the rest of the world not giving the slightest shit. And relatedly, please study figure 72 of the world before you were born, and the world after you're gone, and the world after everybody is gone. Then, please study figure 97 depicting some kind of lucrative interspecies business venture. Don't pretend you've got something better to be doing. You haven't. Besides, shut up. They're cute. Is this angle acute, obtuse, reflex, or the hug we desperately wish we could ask for but have convinced ourselves that the pain of existence must be carried alone on our backs forever and ever? Ava and James sometimes interact digitally. This month, James has responded four, three, and seven days after Ava's messages so as to give the impression he is uninterested, despite being completely infatuated with her. What is James's median reply time, and why will he live miserably ever after? Arthur knows people who are nice to him and people he likes. Please explain why the only people he pushes away are the few who occupy this intersection. An intersection is a point where two lines cross over. Will and Claire intersect on a street. Claire is thinking, Do you know that I still love you? That I will always love you? That I was never as happy as when things were good between us and I wish it could have worked and I'm just so sorry. Will is thinking, Not a day goes by when I don't remember your little and large kindnesses, when I don't remember the new heights of happiness we both climbed together and how sure we were it could never go wrong until it all went wrong and I'm just so sorry. The lines will not intersect again. Why are humans like this? This year, Amelia has suffered a death in the family, a breakup, and several other personal crises. Calculate her remaining resistance to completely losing it when Christopher says, Hey, you look sad. Have you tried going for a run? Have you tried the paleo diet? Have you tried not being sad? A pine cone is the canonical fruit of the pine tree. It isn't sentient, but it also doesn't suffer from possessing sentience. Therefore, would you rather live as a pine cone, a pine cone, or a pine cone? A pine cone experiences neither shame, anxiety, nor the long months that turn grey and numb for no conceivable reason. Using only the terms yeah. and ah. explain what a nice condition it must be to be a pinecone. A pinecone is travelling from west to east at a speed of 300 kilometers per hour. If the driver applies the brake, even if the pinecone bops its head, even if the pinecone gets home that night to find its house burned down or its life in ruins, even if Octolon, custodian of the seven hell realms, manifests in the sky and begins annihilating entire continents with beams of antimatter fired straight out of his ass. Please explain why the pinecone will witness and bear these things with ease, and experience no self-contradiction, no sadness, but merely boundless calm. And for extra marks, please explain why any deity or evolutionary process would curse a species like humans, with a brain just smart enough to recognize its fuck-ups, but not smart enough to stop fucking up. And if happiness is your answer, will you please show your workings? And if happiness is your answer, will you please show your workings? And if... Yeah.